So we know what not to start with. Mm -hmm. Don't start with statistics. Start with common ground on both. It would be tragic for this to happen. And I agree it will happen to Mm -hmm. some extent if abortion becomes illegal. Like, I actually don't suspect it'll be a coat hanger abortion thing. I think most of the illegal abortions in the future will be chemical abortions. And so mm-hmm. it's, 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 it's a different thing. But still, okay, I'm, I'm with you. Women will die. Let's talk about once you want to get, you know, once you're ready to make more like pro-life arguments, once you're ready to counter their view, what are the best things to do? Yeah, so I'm going to draw from uh, Tim's video. Uh, It's called Back Alley Abortion in Five Minutes. Back Alley Abortion Arguments. Oh, sorry. Back Alley Abortion Arguments in Five Minutes. uh, And we will link that in the show notes and you can find it on YouTube. But the first part that I would emphasize in the conversation, once we've found some relational common ground, is I would ask them if they believe that there should be any abortions that are illegal. Yeah. And I would point out the problem. If we say okay, only first trimester abortions and someone wants a third trimester abortion Mm -hmm. and they feel so desperate for that abortion that they're willing to do it on on, on their own, shouldn't we make that legal? Because this is an extremist argument. You cannot pick and choose. And as we know, many, many pro-choice people are firmly against late-term abortion. Mm -hmm. But if you're going to make the back alley abortion for the first trimester, you have to make it for the third. There yeah. cannot be an exception. Yeah. Um, you could even say this for sex selective abortion. Mm-hmm. If they get a gender test with their ultrasound, they find out they're having a girl. They really don't want to have a girl. And now they want to seek an abortion for that reason. Yeah. Um, but we've outlawed sex selective abortions. Well, maybe they're so desperate to kill their baby girl that they're willing to do it in a dangerous way. Right. We should just make that legal too. So like there really are no restrictions you can place. And so that's the first thing I would do is, yeah. is talk through that. 